The Israeli military has released footage of the tunnel where hostages killed by Hamas last month were found. Uh, meanwhile, the Gaza Health Ministry announced that an Israeli airstrike on Tuesday killed 19 people. Our Che Su-hyung reports. In Tuesday local time, the Israel Defense Forces released a video showing the inside of a tunnel in Gaza where six hostages killed by the Palestinian militant group Hamas were found. IDF spokesperson Daniel Hagari himself entered the tunnel's entrance next to walls painted with Disney characters like Mickey Mouse and Snow White. He climbed down a ladder to a tunnel 120 meters long. The tunnel is not tall enough for a person to stand straight without bending and is so narrow that only one person can pass through at a time. The IDF reported that it found the bodies of six people in the tunnel, including Hush Goldball Polin, Alex Lermanov and Kamal Gad on August 31st, and that they had been executed on the 29th. Where you cannot stand. And they survived. But they were murdered by terrorists. And we will keep on doing everything we can. Everything to bring back home all the hostages. Meanwhile, the Hamas-run Gaza Health Ministry said that 19 people died in an Israeli airstrike on Tuesday on the Al-Mawash refugee camp and humanitarian zone. The Israeli military said the attacks were aimed at targeting a number of senior Hamas terrorists. They disputed the Hamas-run Civil Defense Authority's report of an initial death toll of 40 bodies. The Gaza Health Ministry said that 19 bodies were taken to the hospital and 22 were vaporized in the explosion. UN Secretary General Antonio Guterres strongly condemned Israel's bombing and urged for an immediate ceasefire and the unconditional release of the hostages. Chesu Young, Arirang News.